For over 100 years, Quakerism and its values have been at the very core of Leighton Park, creating a peaceful and balanced environment in which to learn and work. Quaker values instill a quiet sense of self-belief in Leighton Park students, allowing them to develop into confident, level-headed individuals. The values most prevalent at the school are equality, simplicity, community, truth and peace. Like the relationships forged at Leighton Park, these values have stood the test of time, remaining unchanged since the school was founded in 1890. They were generally liked very much. Yeah. And they were happy with each other. So it was one... It was a, it was a very, very good and friendly atmosphere. Close community. A very close community. Despite numbers of practicing Quakers at the school decreasing since its early years, Quakerism and its values are still central to the day-to-day -day life of the school. So the Quaker values are quite um, prominent at the school are um, the silences that we have. We have them um, at lunch and then before and after um, collect, start and finish. And I think they're just good times for reflection. And they just, they, they make you pause in your daily life and just stop because everything is quite a rush at school. They make you stop and just think about things that you're that are happening and then you can carry on you can resume your life but I think it's good that we have those just short um, silences just like interspersed within the day so we're constantly being reminded to just reflect on, on um, school life. Uh, there are values in Quakerism which I like and which I can associate with um, one of them is equality. I think that everyone should get equal chances in that. This school has really um, highlighted that um, and has made me realise that everyone should get equal chances regardless of their background. Well, because the quicker value of equality applies here, we call our teachers by their first names. So we get to sort of have a better, closer relationship with them. Yeah, now he shook his head. Yes. What's up in your zone, like? Zoning is that kind of So maybe we're more inclined to learn and listen to them, which I feel is, um, is, is good, it helps us. Another quick value which I find really useful, really helpful, is um, one of the ways which we're treated like adults from um, year nine as much as possible, as, like, as much as you can be treated like an adult from year nine. In the sense that we're given quite a few opportunities to um, express the way we feel in terms of month um, meeting the worship every Thursday. meeting where we can voice um, any queries that we have about school and that monthly meeting isn't exactly a Quaker um, meeting but it is I, I do find that it's got Quaker elements to it because I don't think you'll find many schools where the students have such a, a huge say in what goes on or um, such a prominent voice and I find that that's really helpful because we do help run the school in a way because um, we have thoughts about it. I think Quaker values um, are applied rigorously um, at Leighton Park and I'm really delighted that they are because obviously we are a Quaker school. Many of us who come to the school are not actually Quakers in the religious sense of the word but certainly for me personally I've adopted um, what I call philosophical Quakerism because I very much uh, feel part of that system and the Quaker values that are expanded tolerance, uh, sense of justice, peace, all those things I think are, are vital to the school. And I think what I try to do is um, apply Quaker values in my dealings with people throughout the school, from the students to my colleagues to uh, members of the support staff, uh, and apply a sense of, of, of tolerance and justice and, and peace in your, in your everyday dealings and I think that's at the core of the school. Obviously there are more formal Quaker 
practices. I very much appreciate, um, and I know that most of the students, by the time they're in the sixth form, appreciate meeting for worship, where silence uh, is, is, is vital to our well-being and to our comfort and to our spiritual well-being as much as anything else. And even in lessons, and particularly in my own subject, um, we examine content that is related to Quaker values. But we also use Quaker technique um, within lessons such as silence and the way silence can be productive, uh, leading to things like visualisation uh, and leading also to things like emotional empathy with a, a, another person's sense and another person's predicament. So I'm delighted to be part of a school that um, has those values. Right, we'll finish in the usual manner with a moment of silence.